The government's flagship program, Yes Meghalaya, completed its first year today, July 3rd, and in the last year, it has disbursed rupees 4.5 crore to over 1,300 youths. A function to celebrate the anniversary of Yes Meghalaya was held today at Pinewood Hotel Banquet Hall and was attended by Chief Minister Konrad K. Sangma. Addressing the gathering, Sangma said that there is a huge gap in the activities that the youth would like to do and the support that they get from implementing the activities. He added that there was no systematic way of structuring the financial assistance that was being given to them by the government or departments. So uh, you have so many organizations, so many groups who are doing so many things on their own and there is no support from anybody and yet they do it because they are passionate about what they do. The Chief Minister said that the government is working in a planned and strategic manner so that financial assistance can be given to the youth organizations to carry out their activities. He also said that the Yes Meghalaya program that was so far being implemented through the Chief Minister's Secretariat will now be handed over to the Sports and Youth Affairs Department. And I'm happy that now the Yes Meghalaya program is even more uh, broader. If you remember, uh, we had started entrepreneurship and giving uh, you know, uh, the entrepreneur of the month where we felt that uh, if you recognize people who are doing good in our society, not only does it motivate the person who's doing it, but it also motivates others to be like that person who uh, you know, has achieved something um, you know, great in life. A very important part of really pushing and motivating the youth. For more news updates, subscribe, like and share.